yo, 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 welcome to another edition of Little Bro Vapes. Well, what can I say? Thank you very much to all my new subscribers and the old ones. And like normally, if you like this video, make sure you like, subscribe and share. Well, what's Little Bro been vaping on today? Well, Little Bro went to Expo, yeah, Little Bro to Expo in Nottingham. And it was the Fusion Expo. It was a corking day out. I really enjoyed it and, and I met loads of new people. Um, and if you was there, big thumbs up to you. I had a, a really good day. And also while I was there, I met up with the, um, just let you have a look at that, the Subo magazine people. They were really, really nice. All the um, details will be down in the description, so make sure you check them out. Some great articles in there, reviews, and also interviews. And this brings me on to my next little bit of what I've been vaping. When I, when I went there, I was obviously, there's a number of vendors, and I was reading through the book, and one of the vendors there was the Jack Rabbit Vapes. And I sort of read the interview before I actually spoke to more, went to their actual store. Um, really nice lads, um, Josh and Troan. And basically what they're doing is, is they're looking at how to get around the TPD, which comes in in May, where we've all got to have your 10 mil bottles. And getting rid of your 30s, 50s, 100s, so you can only have your 10 mil bottles. Now obviously, you can actually have... Um, Anything like a 30 mil bottle, 50 mil bottle, 100 mil bottle without any nicotine in it, you can just have your juice because there's no nicotine in it. So, their sort of idea is um, this is the box that it came in, looks really, really good. Um, and their sort of idea is just take the 30 mil size, so you can have a 30 mil bottle with 20 mil of your e juice in it, and then they are going to sell you a nicotine shot. Now, the nicotine that's actually in the 10 mil bottle will mix into there and come out with your uh, desired nicotine um, level. Now I have, um, I think it's three milligram I normally have, normally three milligram. So you put the 10 mil in there, which this is nine milligram, mix it all up at room temperature, and then that's how you get your um, three milligram of 30 mil liquid. So I'll tell you what, I, I, and what, just before I tell you that, we, I walked around and I thought, Spoke to them, I'm going to buy some of this so I can actually review it. So I've actually bought this. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go down, have a little look at the box, and have a look at the bottle, and we'll, we'll actually do the mixing. So let's go down and have a look. So let's have a little look and see how this works. Well, this is the box that it comes in. Absolutely brilliant box. I really do like them. They've gone a proper extra mile on the packaging on this. Um, just at the bottom, it gives you their address. Also, just around here is their logo, which is a rabbit in the in a hat, and also says Jack Rabbit Vapes there. It also tells you just here that if the seal is broken, make sure you send it back, which we all should know that. Also, another one of their slogans, which is Your Juice, Your Way, is all the way around there. And then on the top, you have got, again, the rabbit in the hat logo just there. On the back, you'll see that it tells you the ingredients, and then it also says here this product may contain nicotine and in brackets it says optional there is no nicotine in this and we'll go into that in a little minute um, it tells you which is is toxic um, keep out of the reach of children and may contain nuts also tells you that it is made in the UK the little sticker that will come with it on just on the side there will tell you what flavor you've got I've got the um, creamy melon um, on uh, this one and also it tells you that it's a 30 mil bottle that you're getting in here but also in brackets it will tell you that it's 20 mil of e-juice and that's coming out at 70 vg 30 pg it also tells you that there's zero nicotine in it and also the uh, best before day as well right let's have a little look inside like i said once again i really do like these the the packaging that, that it comes in it's really nice let's have a little look at the bo bottle as you can see, it is a 30 mil bottle, um, but there is only 20 mil of e-juice in it. So I'm, I'll tell you what we'll do is we'll have another close look up at this. Zoom in. All right. As you can see on the side, it tells you that it is a creamy melon. It tells you it's 70 VG. It also tells you the batch numbers and also the expiry dates to it as well. That's the front of it. You've got the logo and also your juice, your way at the bottom. And it tells you all about the ingredients at the back. You have got your childproof cap and also you've got your drip tip there. And if I just do that, you should be able to see that it's not a full bottle. 
Right then, let's zoom back here. Zoom back out, should I say? So there is 20 ml of e juice in there, which is the creamy melon. You can buy this from their website now, with no nicotine in it. Um, you can buy it straight as it is in, in 20 ml. So let's try and keep this simple. Like we've just said, there is 20 ml of e liquid in the 30 ml bottle. As we all know, in May it's going to all change. They are not going to let us have that size bottle or your 50 mils or your 100 mils. They are going to make us have this sort of size bottle, a 10 mil bottle, um, which isn't going to be very easy. So the idea behind this is, obviously, like we just said, there's 20 mil of, of e-juice in here with a, a 10 mil gap. So just say you're, you vape uh, 3 milligrams of nicotine. What the plan is, is they're going to sell a nicotine shot. Now this one is nine milligrams of nicotine. So once you tip that into the um, 20 mils of your e-juice, you tip it in, you give it a good shake um, at room temperature, it will then dilute it down to three milligrams of nicotine and you will have that in your e-juice. They also do it in bigger bottles, which is 50 and 100. But once again, if you check out their website, they do all the calculations for you. So if you're at six or if you're at three, only thing you've got to do is, like I said, go onto their website, work it out which one you want, they send it you out, the e-juice is actually into to this, and they send you the nicotine shot um, separate. So let's do it. So I think we'll, we'll take this off. Of that, make sure we decant all of it out of the actual dripper. I'll just put that there safely, and we take that off. I've already opened it once, and you decant the rest of it all like so. And make sure you get it all in. There we go. And like they did say, give it a good shake. Sure the tops on nice and tight because I don't want to be getting it everywhere. We well, give that a good old shake, and there you go. You have your 30 mil of e juice. So I tell you what, let's go back up, have a little bit of a vape of it because I still want to tell you about how, how great this tastes because I, I did taste it um, at the expo, and we'll talk about it a little bit more. So let's go back up. So that's up and close sort of look at how it actually works. It can look very daunting, and I can see if, you, if you're not a, a really experienced vapor and about juice, and you're thinking, how am I going to work out what my nicotine is? Go to the website, that's going to be down in the descriptions. It, it does explain it that you'll need so many um, nick shots for so much nicotine, and you'll be able to work it, shows you how to work it all out there. So don't get too panicky about it. You're basically getting a bottle that will have either 10 or 20 mils um, taken out of it, what hasn't got any nicotine in it, comes in obviously the lovely boxes like we said. You will then either get one or two of the nicotine shots, which will have the actual, um, the amount of nicotine that you'll need to be able to mix with that to get your desired um, nicotine strength. It's that simple. So make sure you get over to their website and have a look. Once again, like I said, I paid for this because I wanted to um, actually review this. I, um, I liked the taste of it. And I'm going to get to that now. I've got the um, the creamy watermelon. I've got that on my EH Pro Model T coming out at 60 watts at 0.8 ohms. So it's my Model T RDA. So let's have a little bit of the creamy melon. Really do like it. I, I tasted it um, at the expo and I liked it there. It's um, straight away on, the, on your inhale, you're getting your, your, your watermelon. Um, and then just just after it, you're getting your, it's, it's like a cantaloupe, I think they call it, a cantaloupe. And then you're getting the nice, uh, on the exhale, you're getting the nice cream with it. And it is really all nicely set. I really do like it. Yeah, it's even got 
it hasn't got it in it, but to me, it's even got like a, a, um, a bubblegum inhale of the watermelon. Um, and like I said, you've got the, the cantaloupe in there, and then the cream just sits lovely underneath it. Is it my all day vape? It is my all day vape because I love watermelon. It, watermelon is one of my favourites of all time. I really do like watermelon. So yeah, this is it's smooth, it's nice, it's not chemically, it is really, really nice. So I'll tell you what, ladies and gentlemen, this has been a review by Little Bro Vapes. Once again, make sure you check them out. All the descriptions for Jack Rabbit Vapes will be down in the descriptions. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And once again, if you've liked the video, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. And once again, ladies and gentlemen, keep them juices flowing.